Today on iPad 365, we're going to sketch again with an AutoCAD program. This episode brought to you by GoToMeeting. Hey everybody, Jeffrey Powers here. Welcome to iPad 365, the show where we look at apps to keep your iPad in play. It's Wednesday, and of course we've got a utility for you. And it uh, just came out, and I was pretty excited about it. Of course, there's the uh, full-fledged version. We've got this version here, and we'll talk about that in a second. First of all, Twitter handle is iPad365. Second of all, email is iPad365show at gmail.com. Third of all, I don't know, I'm just putting down numbers right now. So anyway, thanks a lot for coming to the show. If this is the first time you've come to this show, Thank you very much. We do this, uh, well, we try to do this every single day. <laughs> things have gotten a little bit hectic with all my travel schedule. So, but now we're, we're getting things uh, settled out, so we should have more episodes out there. And then, of course, on Fridays, you can actually send me a review of an iPad app that you've done, and we'll put it on the show. All right, it's called Sketchbook Inc., and what it is, it's more for the drawers than the painters. Now, it's, it's an alternate to something like a uh, uh, Photoshop where you really want to paint than anything then draw lines and, and touch up photographs so sketchbook this version of sketchbook works with more on the getting the lines as opposed to creating the artwork in the main sketchbook version you can make some really great uh, great stuff in this one it's it's focused mostly on the lines as you can see on one side we have just a series of lines on the other side we have a series of colors on the bottom we have the stroke uh, of the lines and then of course a uh, undo button and a redo button and uh, different other options like this one right here where you can actually choose a background image to your picture so if you decide you choose a background image to your picture but then you can start drawing and start drawing lines like for instance I'm nice little blue line right there I want to undo that because I want to go to black and of course we can draw some faces put some eyes on that put a nose on that and a smile on that and of course some hair now you've got a simple drawing right there it's not anything elaborate from where I am and what I'm doing right now but you can get really elaborate on it I've seen some really cool pictures come out of this program already and it's only been on the shelves a few days so pretty cool program it's a, one of the many drawing programs that are out there for iPad and works really well with the uh, with the retina display on the new iPad 3 so if you want to really get in on your picture and like, let's say, let's uh, put a few lines here like this, then we can zoom back out. So we can zoom back out. And now, of course, he's got a little small little mustache there. And of course, uh, you can save it as a image and you can save it as a very large image or a very small image, depending on what you want to do. If you're just drawing stuff for the web, you want to save it into smaller, uh, smaller files, or you can save it into big files so you can bring it over to another computer to get it printed out or use it for some artwork or something like that. And of course it saves in the ping file. You can you can upload it to your Dropbox or your iCloud, or you can save it as a photo right onto your iPad. Really cool little application. It, there is a price to it. It's very little, it's $1.99 for this drawing application. Hey everybody, GoToMeeting is giving away some iPads and we're gonna tell you about that in a second. But first of all, let's talk about Go to meeting itself. It's summertime, as you can see. I'm sweating. Yes, it is summertime. It's warm in this place. You need to. You're basically on vacation. You're 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 away from your office. You need to meet with clients. You need to meet with colleagues. What do you do? You use a program like Go to Meeting. Using HD faces, you can see them. They can see you, so you can interact in a meeting perfectly. Mac, PC, iPad. It's a great way to keep in contact with your clients keep in contact with your employees and still get your business done and that's the best thing. Got a 30 day free trial by going over to gotomeeting.com, click the try it free now button, enter in the code podcast. Podcast gets you 30 days for free. However, if you wanna win yourself an iPad, all you have to do is go over to Facebook, go over to gotomeeting on Facebook and like that page. They're gonna be drawing for the month of June, the, the end of June they will draw for winners for the iPad. If you refer a friend and they win the iPad, you will win the iPad too. So there's a lot more opportunity for you to get your own iPad. So check it out. Go over to Facebook and like GoToMeeting. 30-day free trial by going over to GoToMeeting.com. Click the Try It Free Now button and turn the code PODCAST.
and that's today's episode. What would you think? Do you, do you like to do the drawing programs? What is your favorite drawing program out there? We've got a ton more that I'm going to be talking about in the weeks ahead. So if your favorite program is not there, let me know. I'll take a look at it, and of course, we'll get it reviewed on uh, iPad365. Twitter handle is iPad365. Of course, you can email me at iPad365show at gmail.com. My name is Jeffrey Powers. Thanks a lot for watching. Thanks a lot for listening. If you're listening to the audio version, we will be back in 24 when it will be another episode of iPad 365. And until then, you guys geek out. You should follow Graphite on Twitter at graphiteinc.